friends, it's Miss Melissa. Hi. Oh, do you see what I have on my fingers? <gasps> I have five little monkeys. And today, our five little monkeys are sitting in a tree. I'm going to tell you a story about our five little monkeys. Five little monkeys sitting in a tree. <gasps> it's a crocodile! Teasing Mr. Crocodile. Na 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 na. You can't catch me. Along comes Mr. Crocodile. <gasps> little monkey sitting in a tree teasing Mr. Crocodile you can't catch me <laughs> along come Mr. Crocodile <laughs> should we do a big snap or a little snap I think I'm gonna do a great big snap Oh no! Where is he? <gasps> Another monkey disappeared! Oh no! Now there's one, two, three little monkeys. Oh no! Three little monkeys. Sitting in a tree. Ooh, ooh. <laughs> Teasing Mr. Crocodile. Mr. Crocodile, you can't catch me. Along comes Mr. Crocodile. Should we do it loud or quiet? I think I'm going to do a quiet snap. monkeys sitting in a tree. Teasing Mr. Crocodile. <laughs> you can't catch me. Along <gasps> comes Mr. Crocodile. Hmm, I think I'm going to do a loud snap. Ready? Here it comes. Mr. Crocodile. I think I'm going to do some fast snaps. Ready? <gasps> oh no! Where is she? Now, there are no little monkeys sitting in a tree. Teasing Mr. Crocodile. You can't catch me. But wait, Mr. Crocodile looks up and sees one, two, three, four, five little monkeys hiding in the tree. Bye bye, monkeys. Bye bye, crocodile.
I hope you liked my story today. I just wanted to share a couple of activities that you might like to do with our, our rainforest or monkey and crocodile theme. Um, one of our favorite activities with a lot of our friends in speech therapy it, that really gets some of our imaginative and play skills um, going is that we'll turn anything that we have available into a magic wand. And we like to pretend that our magic wand can turn the other person into different animals. So I'll say, Abracadabra, turn my friend into a monkey. And then my friend will act like a monkey, act like a monkey, and then Abracadabra, turn my friend back into, and then whatever their name is. And then we can take turns to see if they can imitate that as well. And at first, some of our friends might just come up with the same animals that you give them as ideas. Um, and then eventually, they might come up with ideas on their own. And this is so exciting for some of our friends to start realizing that they can come up with their own ideas. Um, it's really a fun activity. Um, and it gets a lot of movement in there. And um, it's just super fun. Uh, another idea that I thought of was um, pretending to actually be the monkey and the crocodile. You can take turns. Um, and the little monkeys, you can set up maybe little pillows on the ground or things you can hop to. And um, you, as the parent, can be the crocodile at first and, you know, set a game of kind of chase with the crocodile and the monkeys. Um, and it's super fun if you then can be the monkey and maybe you get stuck on some of those like pillows or whatever you're using and our little friends can help you to problem solve how to get to the next step if it's too far away or um, you know you just stand there and pretend like you don't know what to do so they have to tell you jump jump or um, take a step or whatever it may be. Um, so that could be another game that could be a lot of fun to play at home. Um, and the third idea I had, um, you saw in my little story, my little crocodile friend. Um, this is a super simple craft that you could make. It is just basically a popsicle stick that I colored green with a marker. And then I took two pipe cleaners, two green pipe cleaners, and I started in the middle and I wound it all the way around to the front. And then I did the second one and wound it all the way around to the back. And then I added two googly eyes on top. And then I just took a little piece of white paper and cut some jags in it and glued it onto the bottom to make our cute little crocodile. So those are some ideas that you might enjoy. I hope you have some fun with it, and I hope you enjoyed my story, and we'll see you soon. Bye-bye, friends.